Learning your ABCs with all your buddies. I'm Miss Jillian. And I'm Pastor G. Jesus loves you and so do we. Hi kids, turn up your volume for today's Bible ABC video. Today's letter is V. This is an uppercase V and this is a lowercase v. V makes the v sound like in vacuum or volleyball. Vegetable also starts with v, and I'm on the verge of planting my vegetable garden this spring. You could also plant a flower garden, and then you can cut the flowers and put them in a vase, which also starts with v. Yes, but I prefer to grow tomatoes, peppers, zucchini, and beans. Hopefully, I can grow enough vegetables to fill our van. That's a lot of vegetables. What's your favorite vegetable? One of my favorite vegetables to grow is the pumpkin. I love pumpkin pie, and those pumpkin vines get so big. A vine is a kind of plant that sends out branches that are called shoots and runners. Those pumpkin branches can stretch really far away from that plant, but as long as they stay connected to the plant, they can grow some big pumpkins. Our Bible character for today called himself the true vine. Jesus said, I am the vine and you are the branches. And as long as you stay connected to me, you will make great big pumpkins. I don't remember Jesus saying anything about great big pumpkins, Pastor Greg. Verily, verily, but he did say that he was the vine and we are the branches. If we stay connected to him, Jesus gives us life and we will also bear good fruit. Can you explain to the kids what bearing fruit means? Well, pumpkin vines that stay connected to the pumpkin plant can produce pumpkins. We don't grow peppers or beans on our legs or arms, although that would be pretty cool. However, when we stay connected to Jesus, we bear what the Bible calls the fruits of the Spirit. Things like love, patience, kindness, and self-control. That's what our lives should be filled with. And if we look at how patient and kind Jesus is, it helps us to remember to be patient and kind as well. And that reminds us of one more V word. When we remember Easter, we are reminded that Jesus gives us the victory. Well, goodbye until next week. And I'm Pastor G. Jesus loves you and so do we.